Hello fellow surfers, welcome to Flavor Tasters, the food and beverage review channel. And um, my nose is a little bit runny um, because I just had a little bit of hot sauce before. And we're going to be doing a beverage review and this channel is obviously um, more than just food and beverage reviews. We'll be going to talk about cooking, everything food related and health stuff. But anyway, as you can see right here, this is what we got. Let's turn this around. Actually, let's turn this around so you can see the little dangly thing. Ta-da! And it's the same, same color as my top. Well, actually, it's not in person, but on here it looks like it is. So, we got this, which is about £15 via eBay. I've just searched it up. I've seen some for like £30. I would not be spending £30 on 20 tea bags. That's more than a pound a tea bag. So, let's just get a thumbnail of, you can't even see, so I'll just have to put like that. And do that. Or, ooh. Hmm. Anyway, okay, so scent, the scent is the, basically the aroma is very outstandish, the, got a little bit of a tickly nose, the orange is standing out predominantly, lately the cinnamon, actually I need to move my, thing over here I just threw it over there and it's going to look we have me keep on just looking like this anyway okay so the orange and the cinnamon the cinnamon's light um it's almost like a peppery um on earthy shall I say kind of aroma to the underlying um, cinnamon but it's light you can smell like a rubus <coughs> rubus if i'm pronounce it properly but rubus um tea but it's not like it kind of carries the orange the orange is like over it but anyway the, enough of the smelly smell, smell, smelly, smelly, smell, smell. Let's get into this. Watery orange, and I'm not saying that in a bad way. Um, obviously, it's a herbal tea. Oh, then we can go. That would be a good thumbnail, wouldn't it? Ah, yeah. Ah, no, stop spinning. Oh. Anyway, whatever. Oh, cardboard fell in. My nose is still running. Gotta catch it. Anyway, dad jokes for days. Anyway, I'm not a dad, but. I make a good dad with the dad jokes and my herbal teas. Well, you kids, stop running around! Huh? Anyway, <laughs> the sweetness of the kind of the orange is forefront on the palate. The cinnamon, I don't know, like, I'm not getting much of the cinnamon um, standing out. It's kind of hiding behind the orange. <clears throat> the orange is, like the aroma, you can get the aroma of the, be quiet phone. You can get the aroma, and I can feel like my phone's going to be going mental. Yep. Let's get you 
notifications off. Anyway, the the cinnamon's there in the scent. Um, the orange is outstanding, even within the scent. Um, the rooibos is the rooibos, as I pronounce it, has kind of a underlying like it's even less but you can kind of put your nose on it but yeah it it almost tastes like and it's just came to mind if you chop up an orange and you put it in to just water do you know how people like the uh, flavor their water they just put the orange in and it extracts the flavor and it's a light flavor it's kind of like that so i mean i guess it's a good thing is it's if what you would do you know it's tea and tea extracts um heat extracts the um flavors better than cool water so it's almost like it's got the proper stuff in it but i'm, I'm assuming that they use um flavors natural flavors to get that but for 30 pound i would never be buying this for 30 pound 15 pound um for 30 that's what about six i would probably say it's about 60 70 pence a sachet maybe it's a little bit less um 15 pound do you know what? let's do the mathematics um 30 divided by 15 is that even the right way no that's not it's the wrong way around <clears throat> 15 divided by 30 yeah it's about 50 pence actually 50 pence um approximately per sachet maybe it's a little bit less because it's actually just under 15 pound on ebay um i don't think you can get this in stores at least i've not seen it in stores but um it's very flavorful it's you know it's something that stands out Wherefore, sometimes you get herbal teas that you actually have to explore, try and get the flavours and fixate your mind onto the flavour to see if there's something there. But this is straight away. This is like the go-to kind of... If you're wanting to get into herbal teas and you're starting off where the flavours are announced pretty much well on the palate and it's easy... This is a good starting kind of herbal tea to start with to try and figure out your palate um, because the flavours are already there. But you've got to explore for the cinnamon. The cinnamon's not stepping out over the orange, which is a shame. Um, I like it. Now, don't get us wrong. I like it even if you just had it as an orange herbal tea um or you mixed it with something else um i like uh, maybe it's a chamomile tea as well like tea tea bags in i think that would be a nice mix but by itself really for for 15 pound if you can get it for that it's well worth it it's a good start if you're getting into doing reviews because the flavor is announcing and then you can work down with lesser flavoured uh, herbal teas and then you you work down in flavour just gradually so you're trying to explore this is a good starter for anyone but um, <clears throat> 6 out of 10 um, just because it's it says that it's orange and cinnamon but I'm not getting the cinnamon spice I'm just getting a lot of orange and it's a nice taste i'm not saying it's a bad drink just because it's six out of uh, ten it's just it's not doing what it says on the box so i've got to give it a to be fair as much as i like it i personally like it as a like seven out of ten like for myself but I'm, i've got to be fair with the review that it's not necessarily kicking out the actual ingredient orange and um, cinnamon and you've got to you've got to kind of know what you're doing with like 
scents and stuff to actually pick up the cinnamon. It's very late, the cinnamon, so yeah. Six out of ten, it's a nice drink. And it's if you're wanting to get in a herbal drink, uh, herbal tea drinking, this is a good part to start off with um, to test and a good place to start with like the first video you do. But try, like maybe have three or four of them. Be patient and start off. You'll get the orange straight away. I mean, if you don't get the orange straight away, you haven't got a palate. Because orange, like, the citrus of the orange, it just stands out predominantly. And it's easy to pick up on there. So, um, if you really need to, take your time with this one. If you don't get it in the first few tea, tea bags, just stay with it. Take your time. Try and be patient. Because patience builds up the palate. If you're rushing to get to things, you, you're not going to. Yeah. Yeah, just going to bomb through it and you'll just get the main kind of ingredient. <clears throat> this is why I take a little longer on ones which are more... When there's one forefront flavour. But for me, this is a six. Because um, the other one is... It's, it's overpowered by the orange that it's very hard to place your palette on the rest it's there but it's very hard to see like are you really experiencing it or is it just underlying like it's you've got to kind of keep on working to get that flavor so um if you've done a review on this i would love to see your video if you've done content um a review video wise leave your views and opinions down in the comment section below and um, tell me like your YouTube channel and leave a comment and say the name of the um, video so I can check it out. And um, join the Discord. You can give me the link if you want um, in Discord if you do have a video on this. And um, I'm hoping to build a proper community on Discord where we can actually share links. Um, it's not just about this channel. Obviously, this channel is going to be predominantly promoted because it's a flavor taster. Um, me and like Discord, but everyone, if you do content like this, it's a place where we can come together and communicate and maybe just collaborate. Who knows? So, if you do content, let me know about it. Join the Discord, put a link in the Discord, message me. If you don't do content, just leave your views and opinions if you've had this. You know, you can drop them in the comments or join the Discord and chat with people and just say, well, I don't want to do videos for whatever. You know, there's ways that you can do these reviews where you can go, here's the tea, have the camera on the tea and slip and just say, you know, whatever reason, you're not looking for fame or um, you don't want, like, a lot of people, um, whatever, whatever reason, you don't have to be in front of the camera with all of these things. You know, some people can do reviews and you can do like an ASMR style review. You know, be creative. Don't show if you don't want your face on or wear a, a balaclava. I've got one. Um, I could put a balaclava on and do that. You know, and just do it like that. You don't have to show your face, but you can still do videos if you want to. If you don't want to, then that's fair enough. And you can just, you know, speak with um, people that do. And leave your views and opinions in the comment section and say why you agree or disagree and what you liked if you didn't like. And do you like these videos? I mean, it's okay to communicate, you know. And, and you, everyone wel is welcome to join the Discord whether you have a video channel, YouTube channel reviewing or not. Or if you've got a different YouTube channel, don't promote anything outside of food reviews because this is predominantly... Um, for food beverage style videos um, but those type can anyway I'm ranting on too much subscribe hit the notification bell select all notifications strike the like share the content and all the good stuff leave your views and opinions down in the comment section below and also you can check the links in the description and join the discord 6 out of 10 a nice look for me I actually like it I like the orange yeah but some people be buying this and thinking, where's the cinnamon? And that's why it's a six. For me, 
I actually like it. I think it's a seven. A decent um, drink. But I know people will be like, well, see a cinnamon, I'm, I'm not getting it. Especially if they're not used to doing these reviews and it, it's something that they're, they're gradually trying to get to. So, six out of ten. Tell me your views and opinions. I'd love to see your feedback down in the comments. Until next time, get tasting. Thank you.